like sneaking up on me from behind, but she couldn't catch me. I turned around and there she was, and she had packed me with a hug. Didn't you, you little swine? Hello. And there's trouble number two. Hello. And there's trouble number three, hiding behind trouble number two. Name of Jonas. That, that is big trouble. The th they are the three minxes of my life. And there's who I like to call Hernia Boy. <laughs> that is my that is my Uncle Jonathan who happens to be suffering from the after effects of a hernia operation. And I like to make them with me at him. What are you doing? They're staring into my camera. Are you fascinated by the view screen? Yeah. <laughs> We're just out uh, having an evening meal and we are going to order some food. I have all, a tea glass without the flour in it. <laughs> ben, <laughs> this one's from me. You're gonna share it, yeah? Uh, uh. No, Eleanor. Share it with you. No. I, can I? You need to share it with Jonas, but I'm giving it to you as it's your birthday thingy. Hey, Joni, you open one end and then up the other. Oh, just. Rip Just rip it apart, boys. Wow. <laughs> 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 Just demolish them. It's a paper bag. Whoa, yeah. Thank you, Eleanor. You are very welcome. Oh, You're welcome, thank Jonas. You so Yes, well, you've missed something. Oi, Ben, you've missed something. That's yours and only yours. You're welcome, both of you. Yeah, it's a frisbee. Will you mind not blocking my video? I'm vlogging here. It's very rude. <laughs> <laughs> yes, hello cutie. I'm looking around with my camera. So we now had dinner which was delicious and uh, this is actually the rest of the restaurant slash bar. With a very cool Jenga area over there. Um, so this place is really really great but That's now really we are going to head home, um, we are going to go our separate ways but we are going to meet up with the family later in I know. Wait a minute, so you should be coming with me. Okay. Alright, that's my tattoo. Wow, Eleanor, that's exactly your handwriting. It is my handwriting actually. I drew it and then he made a stencil of it and then he transferred it over. Feels a bit weird, doesn't it? Does it hurt? No. Did I or did I not last summer tell you the next time you see me I will have a tattoo? Yeah, I told you I would. Hmm? You like it? Yay! Emma seal of approval. The sheepy. I'm dancing as I leave. Everybody. So not much happened last night, so I'm going to be merging yesterday, last night's, and today's vlog. That is the annoying cousin. Today we are going to be going up Glastonbury Tour. So we're going to be starting here and then we're going to be going up there. But to, to start with, my first challenge is getting out of this car. Out of my way, minions! Oh, oh. So we haven't even gotten to the tour yet and we're already having to climb hills and have that as a challenge. <laughs> but we're going to be having to go up to the show, we're having to be, blah, 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 blah. Having to be. but we're going to be going up the shallower route up to Glastonbury <laughs> tour because my uncle, their dad, um, got a hernia a couple of weeks ago and he had to have the operation for He's it. He's so. hernia boy. Yeah, I call him hernia boy like a superhero. Hernia boy! <laughs> <laughs> I'm 
and there is the first look at the challenge ahead. There is the tour in the distance. It's very small. The lone soldier walks off into the distance in the hope for a better future. Oh, and he comes running back because he's lonely. Oh, Yay! Hey. Do you remember the Olympics? I've been given a new role as a slave. I'm having to not only push myself but other people up the hill. Really? Mum, yes, all three of us in. Wow, we bought the train. Push Emma. Oh, brilliant. going in the wrong direction. No, he's going in the right direction. He knows where he's going. <laughs> well, Eleanor, look at the oh. view! Wow! Amazing! Oh, oh, we're not good. even halfway up! No. I'm out of breath! Oh, oh. Oh. The kissing game, oh. give me a kiss! Mm. Oh, Johnny! Day three of the climb on Glastonbury tour, and we have been left behind by the rest of everyone else. I've been mutinied! We've come up quite a long way, and I say we're nearly. Halfway there, our shipmate is up there somewhere. One of our crew is up there somewhere, acting as a lookout. We meet fellow travellers on the way back down. Lucky souls. They don't have to climb it. We have reached the halfway point. Oh my, I'm in the perfect spot for a windy selfie. Oh, just look at that view. And there is a distant shot of our goal. We're nearly there, people. This is like... Stop. Are you going to dance naked in the rain like the Celts? <laughs> go, 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 go. We'll get him. We will get you. Currently, very quietly. Keeping up upon the indigenous species to Glastonbury Tour. Sheepy is so badass. The woolly sheep. And we have made it. We are on the top of Glastonbury Tour, or I am, and you're with me here. And it is an incredible view. I was actually up here, I was 11 years old. I came to school. Ah, and I've got Upper Jonas again. A little interesting fact about the place, but um, the Celts and their druids used to do rituals up here because I believe it was sacred. And in modern day, when it floods, because all this land is below sea level. This place looks like an island on a hill. Seriously, an island. It's just like a sea all around. Oh, there's an ice cream van down there. Hello again. Oh. Well worth the climb, but not worth the wind. It's ruined me here. But that is an incredible building. Now what we've got to do is walk all the way ruddy down. You can hear everything from up here. I can't see the ambulance, but it seems to be coming from this direction. It could be, oh, it could I be honestly anywhere. Oh, there it is. You can just see it going past that field of players. But I swear, I could probably be standing down on the road and that would sound no different. You'll get this nowhere else. You also won't get that anywhere else. It looks like you can see the entire world from up here. It's just like, imagine doing a 360 up here. We got the whole world in our hands. We got the whole world in our hands. Who remembers that school song? <laughs> if she wasn't holding my hand right now, I would be going flying down the cliff. That is ridiculously steep. Last look at the small castle before we head down. Stay, 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 stay. 
Seriously? At this moment? Yeah. Oh, you were so annoying. Yeah, yeah. So, a last look at this castle. Before we start running all the way down. Dang oh. there! My heart is still going from that. I honest to God could not stop myself from running down that mountain. And I, stuff started falling out of my bags and I had to walk back up the hill in order to go and get them again. Did you film it? Yeah, I did. <laughs> but we're just on the last steps coming down off the Glastonbury tour. We just had a quick pit stop for my uncle as his uh, hernia was hurting a little bit. Yes, and these two are obsessed with getting this camera off me. So if at some point you go off in the Selfie. distance with some random person, it's probably because of them. I'm actually running out of battery, so I will see you at the car. Um, we're actually going past something we went past earlier. That is somebody's urn. It hasn't got any ashes in it because it's got holes on the bottom of it, but I know because there's a note over here saying it's Sister Norma's ashes. A nun being sprinkled on a sacred place. May she rest in peace and all. But the reason why I say this is because this idiot stuck the urn on his head. Head. Yes, you put somebody's ashes on your head. On your head. <laughs> Wait for me! Yet again, I am the last person on this bloody hill! Gang, don't stop! <laughs> she ain't up again! Out of the way! Oh my god! Lionel Messi! Set of and now it won't stop. I have my personal own little alarm system. Click. I think there's a message. It's about crazy. What are you doing? So we've come off first of the door and we're now just in a cafe having a coffee and relaxing. Oh my god, I've just remembered this place. Remember? Oh my god, this was the actual museum I came to as a kid. Yes, yes you did. I remember it because there's all the, like, the clothes that we had to dress up in. And the f boys got to dress up as farmers and we had to wear those ridiculous frilly caps. Oh my god, it was so embarrassing. All the boys were giggling at us. Oh, the boys have found this cow. And he's and Johnny's obsessed with milk in it. It's just water that comes out. You're a milkmaid, Gionis. Uh, you only really wanted to sit on that cow, but unfortunately, um, it's not stable enough for him to sit on it. But um, even though you're not supposed to, I did sit on the cow. That was the key word. What was in here? Oh, what on earth is that noise? Whoa. Oh, I would so get married in a place like this. This is awesome. This is like medieval meets modern. Wow. This place is amazing. Who knew museums could be interesting? Oh, now we've got Ben doing it as well. He's trying to squirt his brother. <laughs> He's trying to squirt him with. What are you trying to do? Ooh. Ooh. Ah, you swine, you've got me! Gee, bugger. Ooh. My cousin has officially gone nuts now. He thinks the tractor actually works. <laughs> Meanwhile, I am sitting on a cow with my cousin. This is not what I thought I would be doing at the end of the day. Okay, pass it through. There's holes in the wall. Look. Ooh. There he is. Hey, Ben. Oh, where's he going? Oh, he's coming around. There he is. 
you, can you imagine like being in one of these walls and just spying on people on the outside i'm now on the big cow i climbed from that one onto this one this is so against the rules we've done we've done it it's overflowing anyway so it is now the end of the day and we are heading back to where my cousins are staying and then me and mother here will should be heading home and then we will be heading down on Saturday with them to Weymouth where we are going to spend the rest of the week annoying the hell out of each other <laughs> um ooh god this job mum's bad driver <laughs> Thank you very much, Chi. <laughs> anyway, I hope you enjoyed this vlog and that you will stay with me for the rest of the week because there will be more to do with the Rovery family and uh, certain things that we should be getting on with that certain people should not be knowing about. Anyway, um, I hope you enjoyed this vlog and that you stay with me. Thanks for watching as always, guys. Leave a like and subscribe and share. One of those three really helps me out. Peace, Peace out. out.